Good morning, everyone. Santa Rondo County Care and Control coming to you live. We'll start with kitties that are in my office. This is Marge. She's a beautiful brown patch tabby in white. Um, she's 13 years old. She's an owner give up. The owner passed away. So she's looking for her forever home. She's a beautiful girl, loves to eat, loves to rest. She's a qui the quiet one of the group. This is Millicent. They are not a bonded pair. They did come in together. Um, this particular one is uh, more outgoing. She tends to like to lie around on my desk and she makes all kinds of cute, sweet noises and she will follow you around and she just likes to be where you are, where the other one just likes to lie on the floor, on her bed. And that's Marge and this is Millicent and both are brown patch tabby and white girls. So we're gonna go out and um, we're going to do um, two other little kitties that are in offices and then we're gonna go do the dogs and then we'll do the cats again. So this is Tomato, he's a brown tabby and white. Beautiful brown tabby and white, about seven months old. He's looking for his forever home. It should be someone who's pretty cat savvy. He's a very, very playful uh, guy and he loves to eat. He's, they're very good with their litter boxes, both of them. And this is the one that he came in with. This is a black and white, beautiful black and white kitty. Um, and he also likes to go up high on the cages uh, in the office and you can see his beautiful He's got a beautiful uh, face and he's um, also, he's the litter mate, so he's also seven months old. And they're both looking for their forever homes. They just need an owner who can be a little bit uh, more cat savvy and uh, maybe has a little more understanding of, of cats in terms of how playful they can be and um, how to give them space when they're going to need it. They were these kitties that, um, the young kitties that came in, you couldn't even really get near them too much um, when they first came in when they were little. So we're gonna do the dogs. Um, welcome to our virtual dog gallery. If you see a dog you like, um, you can um, put in a pre-screen for it. Uh, orange and green backgrounds mean you can meet the dog now. This is an orange background. This is Beats, female. Pitbull mix, and we have Bella, also a Pitbull mix. She's about a year old, applications are being accepted on her. Benzo, also Pitbull. Bruno, Bruno is a Pitbull mix, handsome, given up by owner. Bruno Puppy, he's six months old, 40 pounds, given up by owner. Brutus, um, he uh, is a lovely Pitbull mix. And we have Butterscotch, 10 months old, in a foster home. Capone, also in a foster home. Probably the easiest dog to foster, according to our foster mom. And then we have Cheeseburger. And now we have Chi Chi's, a Chihuahua, uh, 10 months old. Cindy, a pit bull mix, two years old. Now these dogs are also online too, but um, they also tell you when we're in, they're in a foster home. And Debo, Debo is a pit bull mix, about a year old. Um, uh, Doggo is, um, used to be named Uh-Oh, and he's a pit bull mix. We have Douglas, handsome pit bull mix. And Erebus is a great Dane, five and a half years old. Estella is a cane corso. She is found as a stray, she's in a foster home. We have Foxy is a terrier mix, about 32 pounds. And Ghost, Pitbull type mix, really very playful. And if you see this QR code, scan the QR codes and see how playful the dogs are. This is Heaven, Pitbull mix, found as a stray, available for adoption. Homer dude, in a foster home, um, loves to uh, chill out. Kilowatt, given up by owner, available for adoption, asked to meet him. King, American Bulldog, gentle big boy, Lyra, lab mix, six months old, about 40 pounds. Uh, we probably have a, a maximum applications on her. Then we have Major, 
Major's a pit bull mastiff mix, blue eyes, Merc, came in with heaven, pit bull mix, found as a stray. Missy, Missy's a beautiful female uh, pit bull mix. Molly, pit bull mix. Murphy, Murphy is a beagle, found as a stray under routine observation. The skin injury is not new. Um, Nova is a pit bull mix. Oliver, handsome hound shepherd mix, 12 years old. We have Oso, male husky, two to three years old, found as a stray. Then we have Pepper, Prasara canario mix. Then we have Reddy Freddy is a Rottweiler. And Rico, pit bull mix, beautiful blue eyes. And Sarge, handsome German shepherd, three to four years old, found as a stray, he's in a foster home. Scooby, Scooby is a pit bull mix. Slinky is a Chihuahua type mix, uh, arrived with a sweater like that, and since we've and since then it's been adjusted and put on correctly. Snacks, pit bull mix. Sophia, pit bull type mix. Then we have Thicky Minaj, English Bulldog. Treaty, pit bull mix, six months old. Watch Treaty meet other dogs. She's a beautiful girl. Tucker, Husky Malamute mix. One years old, found as a stray with another husky. Vixen, pit bull mix, two years old. Zen, pit bull mix, four years old. 61 pounds, given up by owner. Zuko, Zuko's a pit bull mix, nine years old, given up by owner. Watch our virtual tours, go online and look at them. Gives you an idea um, what the dogs are like. We tell you a little bit about them, the volunteers. Um, have a lot of input because they spend a lot of time with them walking them. So, and then once you decide which ones you might want to see, then you can come in, fill out your pre-screen or bring the information with you. And the pre-screen um, uh, has to be approved and then you can meet with the dogs. And it's a quick 15 minute approval process. And then you can meet with the dog that you like to meet with. Um, all right, we're in the kitty room now. Um, this is Sangwa, Sangwine. He is um, a domestic short hair, solid black kitty. Um, he is new and he's scared, so we have to be patient with him. And he's got beautiful green eyes. Hi, sweetheart. Hey, baby. And he just finished his breakfast. Oh yeah, he's very handsome. He's about 12 pounds, 11, 11 or 12 pounds, big boy. Okay, and then we have Pomona. She's also shy. She's a torty, and she needs a quiet home to blossom. Um, probably an older person who could spend some time with her, or an older uh, family members, uh, older couple. Just spend a little bit of time with her, so she's very nervous, the poor thing. And we have another torty here, and she's a sweet girl. She loves head rubs. Her name is Patches, and she is a, about 10 pounds, about five years old. Very pretty girl. Come here, baby. And the torties, they're interesting because they have all different color patterns, pattern combinations on their faces and on their bodies. That makes them so unique looking. Okay, baby. She's a very beautiful girl. Yeah, aren't you? Beautiful green eyes. Okay. And then we have Boomer. He's friendly, but he's cautious. He's a brown tabby in white, aren't you? Hi. Hi, baby. I see you're cautious. Yeah, I can tell. Hi, pretty. You're handsome very handsome boy. He has beautiful brown tabby markings you can see. Very beautiful, like a little tiger striped. Right, yes. And then we have Lily. She's also a brown tabby in white. She loves to be brushed from head to tail and she'll let you know when she's done with the attention. She does not like other cats, so if you have other cats at home, this one is not for you. She likes, she has to be an only cat, right, sweetheart? 
Yeah, pretty green eyes. Yeah, you have to be an only kitty. And she's about 15 pounds, eight years old. Then we have Samson. He's a black and white seven-year-old. He's scared, he's new, and he came in with some other kitties. So he's a big, big guy, 17 pounds. He'll come around, hopefully. Hi, baby. Cats are funny. They don't like changes in their environment, so they're very cautious when that happens. And then we have somebody in here, Oki, and he is... He's in surgery. Oh, he's in surgery. For neuter? neuter. He's getting neutered because he already has pre-screen, so hopefully somebody will be taking him home soon. All righty. And then we have Baby Kitty. She's a Siamese type seal point. She's um, about 14 years old and she's about eight pounds and she's busy eating. Come here, pretty girl. I'll come back to you in a minute so you can finish eating and we'll get a nice headshot of you. And this is handsome, handsome, pretty Jody. She's a beautiful gray tiger. Blue, as some people prefer to call that. And she is, she is such a soft gray. She's more of a blue gray. She's a very pretty girl. Um, nine to ten years old about nine pounds she likes head scratches but again she lets you know when she's done and she loves to play so these cats can get overstimulated so they're going to be uh, best for a cat savvy person and then we have this little cutie down here named Lacey she's also oh no this is not Lacey this is a bonded pair and this is Garland and Holly. And they are brown tabby and whites. Hi, sweeties. And they curl up together. Hi, baby. No, you're not going to knock me off the phone. And this is the other one. She is a classic tabby with the bullseye marking. And the other one is a mackerel tabby. You can see both of them. <laughs> I know, sweetie. Yeah, so that's Garland and Holly, and they are a bonded pair. Okay. And this is Lacey, and Lacey is a gray. She's about 11 years old. She's very scared, and she's hiding in her litter box. She doesn't want anything to do. She just came in, too, so we have to be patient with her. Then we have Grayson. Grayson is five years old, 11 pounds, handsome, sweet, likes to sit in your lap, may not like the cat visitation room. So, um, and that's, sometimes that just, the noise bounces off the walls and they get very scared in there. They feel very confined. Come here, baby, you're handsome. Yeah, what a pretty boy, pretty green eyes. And there you are. This is Paisley. She's a brown tabby and and a, a little bit of white on her face, but basically she's just a brown tabby. Patch tabby, I see red on her. Yep, she got red markings on her back, so she is a brown patch tabby. Yeah, you pretty girl. You can see the red on her back. Red patches, yep. Right there. She's very pretty. Very sweet girl. About two years old, nine pounds. Hi, baby. Did you eat your breakfast? And this is a, a handsome blue and white, gray and white kitty. That's Perfect Christopher. Everybody's calling him Perfect Christopher. He's a sweet boy. He wants to approach you. He he is afraid um, if you go touching him with your with his hands, but he wants to come near you. So but he's a perfect guy. Hi, baby. Hi, sweetheart. 
He's a big guy. He is 14.8 pounds. He's a big boy. Yeah, you do look funny when somebody tries to touch you, don't you? It's okay. You must have had somebody. Oh, you are beautiful. Look at you, handsome. Look at those beautiful green eyes. Your coat's beautiful too. Yes. The pretty white paws. Yeah. You big poser. So again, this one will need a home where he, uh, people are patient with him and let him come to you, not go chasing him around the house or, or cornering him or whatever, just kind of sitting quietly and letting him come to you. And he'll get over this um, of not wanting to be touched. But he's a tabby, see the M on his forehead? So he's a beautiful guy. And then we have the two bonded ones, I'm going through them. Let's see who else we have some out that are being I guess are being neutered now here's the Siamese she needs a dental she so she's going to be going for a dental yeah baby and she's a seal point hi baby I know you're a talker pretty pretty baby kitty we call her what a pretty girl. So if you see anything that you might be interested in, we're open today till 6. Come on down, fill out that pre-screen, bring all the paperwork that you need. If you're renting, we're going to need, um, well, we'll need a couple things. Um, if you're renting or own your home, we just need, we need proof of who you are. So we need preferably a driver's license. Um, uh, which has your address on it, the current address, or you have to have the address card from the Motor Vehicle Division. And then the next best thing um, you can bring is if you are renting and you just moved to this new place, you want to make sure that you um, maybe have a bill, like an electric bill or something that has your address on it, so that we're sh seeing that that is indeed your address. And so you're, you're going to need the proof of address, proof of who you are. And if you have pets in your home, we're going to need that rabies certificate from your vet. It has to be current rabies. And now we're in with the critters. We have um, a couple of them. We have Stormy, who's a black adult rabbit. so please read up on the rabbits they do require some special care specialized care and she is she's a really pretty girl this is crunchies crunchies is white with gray spots and he is an adult rabbit as well you're pretty but this is a little boy hi babe hi sweetheart hi are you cute? Yeah, you're cute. Aren't you a sweetheart? Hi. Well, baby doll. Yeah. And then we have Mr. Piglet, who's a brown and white guinea pig. He's a baby, and he's very scared. You can see he's in his house. Hopefully, he'll come around. He doesn't have a buddy, which he might need. This is Cakes. Cakes is a white um, adult rabbit, um, and here he is right here. Here she is right here. She's an albino, pink eyes, baby. Hi, sweetheart. Hi, sweetie. Yeah, she's a pretty girl. And then we have these two little bonded ones here, Curtis and Cecilia. And they're babies, they're only eight weeks old. Hi, babies. Hi, yeah. All the hearts are coming up on Facebook because I have your pictures up there, baby dolls. Yeah, everybody's sending hearts. Yeah. Yeah, look, are you coming over? Yeah, oh my goodness. 
Oh my goodness, and they have carrots and celery and all kinds of goodies in there. All right, sweetie pies. <laughs> and then we have this big black and white girl named Tigga. Hi. Hi. And we have another one named Oreo. She's dash me hard. Oh, you were right. <laughs> Come here, baby. No. <laughs> This is, this is Oreo. Very good at her litter box. She's what? Very good at her litter box. Oh, okay. So, um, I will say this. She's very good. This one is very good with her litter box. She's very litter trained. Not all of them are. You have to really work with them to get them to do that. And this is Loki. Loki is a black rabbit with beautiful brown eyeliner. And... He's in his litter box now, too, with eating his hay. Hi, baby. You can see the brown eyeliner around his eyes. He's so pretty and so soft. Oh, you are just so beautiful. Yeah, you are. And this is Crispy. She's another black and white rabbit. She's in her litter box, too. She, he is in his litter box, too. So. And he's busy. This one is busy eating his carrots. So we give him carrots in the morning and celery and sometimes some, some other types of greens. He's going to town eating that. All righty. So if you see anything li you like today... While on our live, you come over and take a look and visit with them. And perhaps you can um, actually fill out your pre-screen, bring all your paperwork to do that. And if you have any questions about what's needed for that pre-screen, you can go online because it will tell you specifically what you need and you can see what has to be filled out. We do have to have proof of rabies. Um, because it is a state of Maryland requirement for any cats, ferrets, or dogs that, that live in your home. Um, and if you um, are in Anne Arundel County, you do have to have a license for your dog or cat. Um, and that can e you can easily get that here um, when you Lexi come in. To receiving. Lexi to receiving. You can e easily get the that license when you come in and um, get, uh, give us your pre-screen. So it's no big deal to be able to do that. Sorry about that. I got a little bit of it sidetracked with interruption. All right. So thank you so much for listening today. And we hope you will come and visit us. We're open today, 10 until 6. We're open Thursday and Friday and Saturday. And we are open 10 till 3 during those days. The dog gallery closes at 2 o'clock on the weekdays to allow for second feeds. So if you are coming to visit a dog, you want to do so before two o'clock. All right, and thank you so much, and we will hopefully see you soon. Again, if you have any questions, give us a call. Thank you.